What is going on guys and girls, my name is Van Gogh and today we have got part 13 of You Choose, I Use. We left you with the goalkeeper and the two strikers. In goal we decided to go for Jason Steele, plays for Middlesbrough, he is English so he links up well with Kolka. There was a couple of suggestions for players um, that were in the Premier League and English but unfortunately they were rare silvers and we wanted non-rare silvers so I had to ignore those comments, I do apologise for that guys. And up top we go for... Poloski and of course Gabbiadini. I think you say his name Gabbiadini, I'm not sure. All I know is, is that it was expensive. He was about 9,000 coins. I'm, I'm going to say he is definitely worth it because he's a very good player but for a non-rare silver that's an incredibly high amount of money. Or coins, should I say? His left footed as well. I never realised this. I was in the game later on. I was actually shooting with his right foot. Uh, should have paid attention. He's got a good heading as well and really good pace. So that makes it makes a quite a good striker. And he works well with Pelosi next to him as well. So we're going to get into a game now, guys. And I'm just going to straight out say this is probably one of the most strange games I've ever played. Uh, the 45th minute seemed to last longer than the whole of the first half. It was crazy. Uh, we do actually start off really well. Berger doing a couple of a couple of skill moves. Great pass to Kacaniklic and he scores a goal. Volley in the top right corner. We get through on the break. Weidenfeller makes an absolutely great save. Double save, in fact. And then this happens. The guy gets through, does a really good skill with Royce, crosses it across, and, well, it's a little bit of a fag goal, but Gundogan manages to get it over the defenders and keeper. Uh, because he fagged first, I decided I'd be a little bit cocky and double fag him in and just walk it into the goal because, you know, I got pretty annoyed at the fact that he played it across goal with an open goal but from this moment on I didn't fag it once I tried to score you know fairly average or decent goals that was a good finish from Berget there and this is what I mean by the crazy 45th minute it just kind of lasted forever first of all there was a penalty and usually when it comes to 45 minutes lasting a long time it basically lasts until the opposing team scores a goal with me and that's my luck because usually I was expecting as soon as this went in uh, the kickoff gets taken off and that's it. Time for the game to end. But for some reason, we scored about two or three more goals in this uh, 45th minute. It was insane. That was an absolutely beautiful finish though from Pelosi. I'm not sure if he's left footed or right footed. Ah. Uh, there was three goals in that 45th minute, sorry, I don't know why I said there was extra goals. I was going to say, if there's a 45th minute of like seven goals, then you're in for a very lucky game. But kick off and straight away, Pelosi just runs through again, scores another goal. Does a quick 1-2, Gabbiadini heads over the goalkeeper and that makes it 6-2. And at this point, I was feeling bad for the other guy. I didn't want to score any more goals, but... Yeah, you can't exactly not attack, can you? I don't want to pass it around my defence or midfield just to seem like a bit of a you know an asshole, but I just kind of just chilled out after that. <laughs> I was texting for a little bit of it, I'm not going to lie. Uh, seven to up, you're not going to lose, are you? So I thought, why not? And that is it now. We are nearly champions. I think two more games and we'll have it in the bag. All the players that we bought last episode, guys, are now sold on. We're up to 14k, and I'm thinking about maybe buying an inform for next episode. So if you know anybody that's good to trade with, do let me know. I'm going to attempt to try it with Joey Barton. And guys, the last thing we're going to want from you is a centre defensive mid, a centre back and a right mid. They all have to be non-rare silvers and I would prefer if they linked up well with Burgett so we could get 99 chemistry. I know it's possible, I have been having a look, but it depends on what you guys want. If you want to throw other players in there, then by all means suggest them away. Thanks for watching guys. If you have enjoyed this video, please remember to leave a like, comment and as always, subscribe.